it's a lot easier to change and it's a lot easier to change your beliefs, your stories, and to get results in life if your uh, brain chemistry and body chemistry are more balanced. A lot of people eat really bad diets and those really bad diets seriously affect your brain chemistry, your body chemistry, and your ability to change. So everybody has an idea on what is the best diet to help people shift their reality. And the honest truth is, is I don't know if there is a best diet. There's a best diet for you. And there's not necessarily a best diet for everyone. The key though, is, and there's fundamental keys when you look at all the diets, is to get all the crap out of your diet. For example, I've seen really healthy vegetarian diets and I've seen very unhealthy vegetarian diets. I've seen very healthy vegan diets, I've seen very unhealthy vegan diets. I've seen very healthy um, uh, meat-eating diets and I've seen very unhealthy meat-eating diets. When you look at healthy people, people that uh, have a lot of energy, they're, they're in good shape, they wake up easy in the morning because they feel good, they've gotten the good nutrition, is they are all cutting out uh, certain foods, crap, the crap foods, you know, white sugar, white flour, unhealthy oils, things like this. And so what I tell people is make sure you cut all that out and then pick a diet that really works for you. If you're really on the paleo end and you want to eat meat, go for it. But don't be eating a bunch of bread with it and sugar and junk food. Maybe on occasion, you know, you're at a, you have a, a piece of pizza here and there. But if you really want to make the changes in your life happen fast, it's time to get the diet under control. Go out and, you know, start taking a look at this. Look at what you're doing now. Start cutting down on the sugars. Start cutting down on the fat. Start cutting down on the extra unnecessary carbs, all the white flours and all that stuff, which will not only help you lose weight, but feel better, have better chemistry, function better in life. Let us know what diet works for you and what you've done to clean up your diet and how much better you feel a after doing that. I mean, just a week's worth of change in this area, some subtle changes, doesn't even have to be much, can cause a huge reaction in some people's lives who have been eat living on junk food their whole lives. I grew up basically on pizza, soda, Coke, junk food, sugar, with a lot of work and a lot of changing and a lot of changing in my thinking. I had to let all that stuff go because it was really messing up my life. Those changes were essential in allowing me to make the changes I needed to make up here to get the results I needed to get out here in my life. Because without those changes, I would have been too depressed, too heavy, too lethargic to really implement the things I needed to implement to get the results I wanted to get, whether it's with women, with confidence, with life, or with money. I used to obsess over these goals, like how am I going to have a good life if I don't have good money, or how am I going to have a good life if I don't accomplish X goal or Y goal. The problem with that is that goals never end. Part of our evolution is to learn to manage the greater capacity of information and teach our subconscious to sort for what we want out of it.